I went to hell. Yes, me, someone who believed in the Lord Jesus, went to hell. And when I landed in hell, I was horrified, horrified. And then the Lord was completely gone. The feeling of knowing that you can never leave or get out of there. The Lord was gone. The all hope is gone. And there is no do-overs. And I thought I was doomed forever, forever. I thought I was doomed. And I thought, oh, what have I done? And then I turned around and there were steps. The Lord is so merciful. He loves me. He was just warning me. I ran up those steps. And when I ran up those steps, I was back in my bed. And when I picked up my phone, it was three days later. Of course, I made a super long story short. But three months, I followed the Lord's commandments, faithfully followed the Lord's commandments, started understanding the seriousness of sin, knowing all my life I had it wrong. I really thought that when the Lord said he wanted a relationship, I just thought it meant you pray and, and, and you go to church. But I didn't realize it was a real relationship where you speak to the Lord and he speaks back. I prayed to the Lord and I said, Lord, I just don't understand why. Lord, why did I go to hell? And then I heard the Lord say, to me look back at your life and when I looked back at my life I realized why I went to hell because I went my entire life living however I wanted not understanding the seriousness of sin just just assuming oh the Lord understands this is the modern world the Lord knows I love him the Lord knows I have a good heart that's just wrong it's the devil's lie it's been the devil's lie the entire world thinks that that is not the truth the truth is that we are to live for the Lord every second of every day Pray to the Lord, repent to the Lord, and ask for the Holy Spirit. I broke down and I cried and I said, Lord, now I know why I went to hell. How I love you, Lord, that you did not throw me away, but that you warned me that I have been blessed beyond measure. Do you know how thankful and grateful I am that you warned me? Do you know how many people just die and never get a warning? The Lord warned me. I am so grateful. How could I ever, ever leave the Lord? And the next thing I knew, I saw this mist come upon me, this mist. And then all of a sudden, when the mist touched me, I was instantly transformed. I am talking instantly transformed no longer did I curse no longer could I stand sin I can't even handle being around people that that, 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 that curse or sin or offend the Lord in any way because I feel like I am getting stabbed by a knife anyway the Lord is just so wonderful and so beautiful and so amazing and he gave me his Holy Spirit and I now I'm able to speak to the Lord every minute of every day I love the Lord and I talk to the Lord every minute of every day and that's all I care about is my Lord Jesus Finally, uh, 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 around a month later, I prayed to the Lord. I said, Lord, when you came to me in October, you were not in your glory, my Lord. If you are happy with me, will you please come in your glory, my Lord? And then a few days later, the Lord came to me in his glory. I was laying in my bed, and there's a picture against the wall that's covered with glass. And all of a sudden, I saw the Lord appear in my window. I could see through the picture this super, super bright light. I'm talking to the brightest light I've ever seen. And I heard them singing in heaven. The Lord get into the kingdom of God.